Um, each year at the summit, it is my genuine honor to introduce, to introduce the Lenore Annenberg Prize for Art and Social Justice. It's named after Lenore Annenberg, who was a true advocate for the role that culture and education could play in social justice. And uh, the prize is brought to us by a very treasured board member at Creative Time, Lenore Annenberg's granddaughter, Elizabeth Sorensen, with support as well from Lenore Annenberg's daughter, Elizabeth Kabler. And before we introduce this year's prize recipient, Fernando Garcia Dori, who, by the way, we fell in love with immediately. His practice is so interesting, and he's such a wonderful man. And I can't wait for you to hear about his work with pastoral and nomadic peoples all over uh, the world. Uh, really fascinating practice. Uh, but first, it is uh, my pleasure to introduce to this stage my very dear friend and often collaborator, Tom Finkelpearl. Many of you know that Tom is the director of the Queen's Museum of Art. I think he is radically reinventing what it means to be a museum engaged with community. And uh, we've been very blessed to work with him. He was one of our jurors for the prize as well as nominator. I want to thank our, our international nominators. I want to thank our prize jury, which in addition to Tom also included last year's prize recipient, Jana Van Hasvig, as well as Jack Prosekian. And um, I'm also excited to say that Tom has a new book coming out on public art uh, called The Ch Change We Make. No. What is it? It's uh, what we make. <laughs> what we make. What we make. Uh, so it is my pleasure to introduce you to Tom Finkel 